Here is a Honer pressed wood um, pre-poker work uh, button accordion, the keys of C and F. Uh, this is a, a family heirloom that I've now restored. Uh, it had had some sort of amateurs work done on it that I had to do some re-repairs on. The keyboard particularly was uh, sort of poorly re repaired. But now I've got it nice and solid and uh, uh, working well. <clears throat> there was uh, the base uh, block I had to re-glue. Uh, the glue had been separated. No broken wood, but uh, the, uh, it was starting to separate, so I was able to fix that. Uh, there was one pallet. They had sort of uh, put an extra layer of padding on the uh, outer row of pallets, and one of them was only half a piece of material, so it actually allowed a leak. Uh, so I uh, just put an all-new cushion pad there that seemed to work okay. The entire instrument was at uh, 870 or 435 uh, reference frequency. So now I've brought it back up to the modern A440 uh, using the Viennese style uh, tuning on it. Uh, what else? The grill cloth was starting to separate and I, it had already been replaced but it wasn't really sticking so I fixed that. Uh, the keyboard I think I mentioned I w was uh, repaired. I think I have a picture of me clamping the clamping that back together. I did add a couple things that are more common on modern instruments that help. There's a, there's a crossbar between the two treble reed blocks to uh, minimize uh, undesirable resonance or wah-wah effect I call it couple of the high reeds, I, I did dry, dry, um, drill some holes to relieve the pressure just because they speak better. <clears throat> Probably the biggest challenge, I did find some uh, basically bad reeds. The reeds were working, but they uh, 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 proper accordion reeds are not supposed to change pitch when you change the pressure uh, or how hard you're playing. Playing loud or soft, it should be remain at the same pitch. This had, uh, I think, I've replaced three or four of the reed plates on it because the uh, reeds were bad. I've got a little demo showing that. That so here's some uh, bad reeds. Uh, if the tremolo changes frequency based on how uh, hard you're pushing or pulling. And uh, one of those two bad, uh, reeds is uh, is bad. This has a problem both push and pull. I'm hoping they're on the same reed plate, but they may not. In fact, I had one where uh, of the two reeds, one of them, if you went higher in pressure, it would uh, the pitch would lower, and the and the paired reed. The pitch would actually raise uh, raise up, so that was a terrible combination because as you changed it, the tremolo changed drastically. Uh, anyway, so I I had to actually there's no way to fix those uh, when a reed does that. There's no way that I know of to remedy it besides replacing it. So uh, I've I, I have older you know Honer reeds that I was able to use for that. So well, I'll go through the notes. I have tuned it with about I think t two to two to five hertz uh, tremolo on the tr tr treble side.
compressed wood in CF. Uh, Grandpa's old box now ready for another generation or two before needing more wood.